Are you nuts? Don't you know it's Science Day in Mrs. Jewel's class? You could have gotten crushed. Ow! Why'd you do that? Marisha loves his hair. Do not! Ow! Marisha, please stop punching the monkey. I don't punch monkeys. That's true. Well, then you must be the new student. We're so happy to have you here, Todd. Class, let's all welcome him in our own special way. Hey, Todd! Hello! 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 Hello. 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 Ah! You're hot! Thanks. But I didn't break any rules in my last school. Did you stand on Did your you head? Did you activate library books? Fight for me! Yes! Hey, you got a girlfriend? I'll help you, Todd. You're not gonna hit me, are you? Hit you? Why would I do that? I offer to help, and all you can do is criticize me? This relationship is all about you! 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 Relationship? Forget about it, Todd! It's over! <sighs> That's a relief. Don't worry, Todd. I forgive you. <laughs> Ow! Oh, here's a vote for Dear Todd. I think you are so cute. Oh, and there's a bunch of hearts drawn on it. <laughs> That's not a vote either. It sounds like a secret love note. Oh, my. Love is oh so wonderful, students. Secret love is even more so oh so wonderful. Okay, now who does this belong to? <laughs> I don't mean to embarrass you, Todd, but I think this is yours. Me? Technically, it belongs to the trash can. Ballot bucket! Oh, no fair! Rules are rules, Mr. K. Stupid wall, it's poking me. Ah, no talking to the walls, Marisha. You want your name on the board with Todd's? <sighs> Wait a minute. Todd! I don't think we're going to make it. I can't hear anything, Marisha. This stuff is too hot. <gasps> Did you hear that, Fluffy? He thinks I'm hot. I can see it now. Marisha and Todd, Todd and Marisha, rollerblading together, hand in hand at the beach. I'll bring my boxing gloves. Oh, Todd, are you sure? Careful, Marisha, this whole thing could explode on us. Just let it, Todd, let it explode. It's gonna be big. It will be big. Love is big. Love is gigantic. Love is all around us. Can you feel it? Todd, it's like I said in the note I wrote to you before. I love... Major Dor, coming through. You mean Major Guzak. No pushing, please. Yeah! We're not gonna be squished. Squash, dear. <laughs> Enough with the fun. <gasps> Where's Marisha? Don't worry, Fluffy. Mommy's here. <laughs> Remain calm. Your hero is here. Go in there and rescue Marisha and Fluffy. You gotta be kidding. I'll go. <laughs> Jump down. It's too far. I'm afraid. I'll catch you. You will? Bye. I, I think so. Oh, Todd. <laughs> that was so sweet, Todd. Oh, no. Help. We're stuck. Life's not a spectator sport. Life's a contact sport. Like checkers or... Tic-tac-toe, nice sitting with three down left on the 
center square of the end zone of the ice show. That's what I'm talking about! Wanna see me flick it again? No! Yes! Coven leader, calling Raven. Target garbage can. Over. Roger. Ooh, a lucky penny. Ow! Hey, Todd. You dropped your butt arrow. What? That's not my butt arrow, whatever that is. Here, you take it. Ah, uh, Todd! For me? That's so sweet! Dana, why are you pushing my desk? I'm not pushing your desk. You're being moved by the power of love. No, it's not the power of love. It's you. How do I know this? I can see you. You are right there, on the floor, pushing my desk. There. Happy Valentine's Day! Hi, Todd. Ah! Don't hit me! Hit you? When have I ever hit you? Ow! 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 Are you in love yet? No, of course not. Oh, don't worry. You will be. You two just need to be closer. Hey! Too close! Too close! Ah. Ah. Was that my back? No, Todd. That was the sound of your heart breaking for Mauritia. What a cute couple. Janella. Ah. Mrs. Jules! Todd pulled my ponytail! No, I didn't. I was just holding it when her head moved. Todd. No, no, puss are so ponytail. Oh, excuse me, I meant to say, Todd, no pulling her ponytail. But it was an accident. An accident we call love. Really? No. No, it wasn't an accident. Or no, you're not in love. Y yes, no, I mean. See, Todd, love really is complicated. But I understand it. By pulling Mauricia's ponytail, I think you've finally found a way to express your feelings for her. The way she expresses her feelings for you, by punching you. Huh? It's a good thing you two have finally worked it all out. Now we're getting somewhere. No, that's not how it works. See, we're sitting so close and your hair was in my face, I was trying to stop it, so I grabbed it like this. Mauricia, please turn around and face La Maestra. Which is me. Okay, Mrs. Jules. Ow! Todd pulled my ponytail again! What? No, I didn't. I mean, oops. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Todd, that really hurt that time. It really hurt. Todd, if you pull her ponytail one more time, I'll have to circle your name and send you home on the kindergarten bus. Where you can think about your love for Mauricia. <sighs> Todd! Todd! Stop! I was just running out here to say, I know about everything, Todd. About the desk, the ponytail, and how Dana was forcing you to fall in love with me. You do? And I know you were just trying to help. But, Todd, I don't hate you. And I don't want you to, you know, be forced into whatever. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, did she really think that getting you to pull my ponytail would somehow bring us both together? I mean, that's ridiculous. Yeah, ridiculous. <laughs> 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 Well, I better get going. Okay, see ya. Hey, Todd. I wrote about all my feelings. How about you? What you thinking? Is it about me? No. But I was just wondering about something. See, I need things to make sense. And a class taught by a cow that doesn't make sense to me, does it? I mean, am I really a fun pooper? Oh yeah, a big time fun pooper. But I still like you. Hi, Todd. Hey, Mauricia. I'll miss you guys. I really will. 
And I'll especially miss you, Todd. Hey, where's Todd? I'm over here. Just making sure the door doesn't hit you on the way out. Aw, that's sweet. Why would it ever do that? Okay, we do science now, yes? Oh, Todd, I miss you. Are you sure you want to come back here? I miss all my friends, all my good times. Oh my Todd. Are you are you crying? I can't take another second in that stupid smart class, Todd. I hate it down there. I'm just so alone. There, there. You always know just the right thing to say to me. I do? So will you help me? Uh, okay. There, there. No! I mean getting out of the stupid smart... And I never would have been able to get back to my friends. Oh, my friends, my friends, my friends, my friends. <laughs> and back to my Todd. There, there. I know who inspires me. Don't you think Todd would make a great mascot, Fluffy? <laughs> Big Head Todd inspires me so. I love you, Todd! Todd! Tag, you're it! I know who I'm going to tag. Me? Oh, Todd. Uh-oh. Yes, I'm safe. No. I'm it. <laughs> oh, Todd, I think you're the cutest king I have ever seen. Ah! What? But if I can't punch Todd, how will he know I still like him? And if he doesn't know I still like him, how will he carry on? Everything is ruined! <laughs> so sweet and juicy. Like my love for Todd. all alone in that lonely raft. Wouldn't it be nice to have some company? Um, I'll be okay. Avert your eyes, Todd. No incredible undersea adventure for you. You don't have a permission slip, remember? Oh, no. I don't have a permission slip either, Mrs. Jules. Yes, you do, Maricia. I just saw it in your hand. What happened? Um, I accidentally ate it. Oh, dear. Well, you shouldn't go in the water right after eating. I'm afraid you'll have to spend the day in the dinghy with Todd. Yes! No! Oh, Todd, what will we ever do? Just the two of us trapped together in the middle of nowhere. We're not exactly in the middle of nowhere. We're in the middle of Mrs. Jewel's class, in a lifeboat. This isn't a lifeboat, it's a love boat. Why don't we hold hands no. and drop anchor over by that romantic private island? First of all, that's not an island. It's a filing cabinet. And secondly, holding hands is death. Shh, don't speak, Mon Capitan. The whales are serenading us. Huh? 
Todd, can we hold hands now, huh? No. Oh. Then can you do me a favor and hand me that paddle? That's not a paddle. That's your hand. Oh, is it? <laughs> Silly me. <laughs> um, Todd, can you do me a favor and hand me that rope instead? That's not a rope. That's your hand. Oh, is it? <laughs> Silly me. <laughs> um, Todd, can you do me a favor and hand me my hand? That's not your hand. It's your hand. Who made you go? White dove must be love. Stamp it, lock it, no erases. Oh, Todd, you sent me a message in a bottle? How romantic. S-O-S. What's that, Todd? Some kind of secret love code? Actually, it's an international distress signal used by sailors. Oh, I get it. S-O-S, as in sweet on schoolmate. You really are a true romantic, Todd. Look, Mauricia, we need to help. What? They look like they're having the time of their lives. I know I am. Want to hold hands yet? No. <laughs> Mauricia, uh, can you help me a second? I need to reach that permission slip. You can have my permission slip if you want. Uh, no thanks. I just need to lean out and grab that slip. So, could you... Would you? Hold my hand. <gasps> Hold your hand? Why didn't you say so? I would love to. Oh, Todd, how sweet. Even after all that, we're still holding hands. Oh, I just want this moment to last forever, Todd. It feels like I'm giving you goosebumps on your hand. Mauricia? <laughs> but technically, I didn't save the class. I was just trying to get away from Mauricia. Ready when you are, Mon Capitan. Dance! Just follow my lead, Mauricia. Todd, this is gonna be awesome! Please, Maurizia, take my hand. Oops. Hmm, practicing the power moves, are we? Not bad. But you've got to stick that landing 344. Ah, uh, Mr. K, I don't think that was a dance move. Ow! Way to go, Todd! Bravo! This time with feeling. I have no feeling in my shoulder. Ow! One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, Ow. three, four, five, six, one, two, Ow. three, one, two, three, one, two, Ow. three, four, five, six, one, two, Ow. three. Six. Oh, Principal Todd, I got in trouble for passing this love note. And Mrs. Jewel sent me to your office. My office? Mauricia, I don't have an office. But I broke a rule. And I'm not really the principal. You can give me detention. And I have this whole list. Detention by candlelight. And I'm trying to fix this broken school and... What about my broken heart, Todd? Can you fix that? Like I said, I'm not really the principal. I mean, uh, I'm not the heart-fixing, uh... Hi, Principal Todd. I got sent to your office again for passing a love note, which may or may not be about you. Just what I need. Give me that love note. Ooh, which one? All of them. Oh, Todd, I'm so excited you're finally reading the most secret things I've ever written about you. <clears throat> it's time you knew how I feel, Todd. Let love rain down on us. Uh, this isn't working. You're telling me this relationship really isn't working. Are you supposed to be a car dashboard? Yes, 
And the best part is, I've got driver's side airbags to protect myself from any sudden impacts. What kind of sudden impacts? <clears throat> Hi, Todd. Come back, Todd! Why are you always bouncing away from me? Wanna dance, Todd? Ugh. Please, 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 please! No, Mauricia. I just got bounced halfway across the school. I need a break. What? You want to break up with me? Huh? No, no, that's not what I said. And besides, we can't break up because we're not even going out. But, but... <laughs> Mauricia, are you okay? I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. My feelings, Todd? Step away from the vehicle. I repeat, step away from the vehicle. <laughs> Ooh, I've always had a thing for the strong, silent, handsome type. Did you hear that, Todd? <sighs> Look, Mauricia, I'm sorry about what I said before. I do like you. Talk to the hand, Todd. I've just met me a mystery man. Look, buddy, I don't know what's going on here, but Mauricia's my girlfriend. I mean, my friend who happens to be a girl. My friend girl. That silent treatment won't work with me, pal. Something smells rotten, and I think it's you. Hello? Anyone home? Sammy? Mauricia fell for a dead rat? <sighs> She'll be heartbroken when she finds out. I can't let that happen. No! Sammy! Todd? 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 344 South Fairview? Todd, where do you put Sammy? We exchanged costumes. I just couldn't let Mauricia see her new love was a dead rat. It would break her heart. Oh, why you not say so? You in love with pony-headed princess! Yay! Oh, well, I don't know about that. I mean, come on, me? In love? What's that, Todd? You're in love with me? Oh, Todd! I knew it was you in that costume all along. Wait! No, 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 I... Ah! Oh, Todd. Oh, Todd! Don't you want to sit closer to me while we tell scary ghost stories around the campfire? Um, no thanks, Mauricia. But who'll protect me if I get scared? I feel so vulnerable. You? The toughest girl in school? All you ever want to do is punch me. You're just too rough. No, I'm not. I... I must not hit Todd! Ow! You are too rough. Now will you sit with me? Sure, if I actually believed that story. What? Do you really want to take that chance, Todd? After all, who will protect you from Mrs. Gorf? Ah, that's not really Mrs. Gorf, is it? Ow! Todd and Mauricia. Ah. <laughs> Coming through. Students.
attention. Todd plus Mauricio, heart. <sighs> uh, Lewis, that's not a message. It's a love note. Who put this here? <laughs> Where's my message about secretly firing half the faculty? Mauricia, you've got to stop putting our names in hearts all over the school. Huh? But, Todd, whatever do you mean? <laughs> Face it, Mauricia. I'd rather do anything than be your boyfriend. Would you kiss a dead rat? Yes, anything. Would you live in Antarctica? Yes. Would you eat Miss Mush's mushroom surprise? Yes. What? what? Is he on me? You'd actually eat Miss Mush's mushroom surprise? Um, yeah. Oh, yeah? Well, prove it. Eat it. Okay, I will. Fine. Right now. Let's go. Maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Really? So you'll be my boyfriend? Miss Mush, bring on the surprise! <gasps> Don't do it! You know, it's not that bad. Mauricia. Yes, Todd? Helmet. Anything for you, Todd. Ribbon. <laughs> Do you want a lock of my hair to go with it? <gasps> Dana, what's with Todd? It's like he's fallen madly in love with Mrs. Jules instead of me. And after all I gave him, my helmet, my ribbon, my heart. Uh, but Mrs. Jules, there is a gondola canal here at Wayside. I can show you. We can take a ride together, please. Hey, aren't you gonna punch him? No, I... I can't. He's hurt me too much for me to hurt him today. Aw, come on. You can still hurt him. Besides, I'm sure Todd still cares for you more than he cares for Mrs. Jules. I don't think so. I mean, you saw it. He'd rather eat Mushroom Surprise than be my boyfriend. Hey, maybe that's it. Maybe he's just sick from eating the Mushroom Surprise. You mean like food poisoning? No, more like love poisoning. <laughs> Checkmate. Oh, how you do that, Sammy? Miss Mush, you've got to help us. We think Todd had a bad reaction to your Mushroom Surprise. Dead? Much worse. He's hopelessly in love with our teacher, Mrs. Jules! Ah, oh, not again! Science teacher eat mushroom surprise once. He fall mad in love, too! With cactus. Ooh. Wow, how did he get cured? Cured? You're right, Miss Mush. There is no cure for love. There, there, you said. You eat. I give you baloney uh -huh. freezy. It's like ice cream, but no cream or milk. Mostly just baloney. Thanks, Miss Mush, but I can't eat right now. I'm so upset, I feel nauseous. You in right place. Baloney freezy make many people throw up. Of course. That's what we have to do. Throw up? No, make Todd throw up, just like if he had food poisoning. You mean, if we get the mushroom surprise out of Todd, maybe he'll fall out of love with Mrs. Jules and in love with me? Either that, or he make big mess. Hello, Todd. Are you feeling better? I sure am, now that you made Mauricia take down all those hearts. Phew. I'm so glad that's finally over. Huh? <laughs> oh. Hi, Todd. Ah! Have 
you been thinking of me? I've got this new photo album. Want to see? Sure. Maybe later? Then it's a date! Huh? Hey, wait up! <laughs> oh, there you are, Fluffy. I'm just rearranging some photos. Hmm? <sighs> Can you hold this for a second? Doubles. So, Todd, anyway, after we find Fluffy, I thought we could celebrate by holding hands. What do you think? Todd? Todd? I've lost Todd! <laughs> Did you find Fluffy? No, and now Todd's gone too! <laughs> Don't worry, we'll find them. Jenny, what are you doing to Todd? Don't sweat your socks, Sister Mo. I planned that jump perfectly. No way I could have hit Todd. Hit Todd? Why would anyone hit Todd? Ow! 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 Aw, oh, Jenny, I was on the fifth level. Ow! Oh, Todd. Jenny? Uh, hi. I heard what you said before, and what you did... You, my friend, are the ultimate challenge. Um, yeah, I was afraid of that. Look. I want to stop this before it gets out of control. I'm already sort of involved with Mauricia. <coughs> Emphasis on sort of. <laughs> so I'm flattered that you like me so much and feel the need to show me. But I don't think it's going to work out. Sorry. I figured it was the only way to get through to you about our, you know, relationship. What relationship? Oh, man. Here he goes again. You, my friend, need help. Relationship? This is crazy, Todd. I mean, I like you, but in a punch you in the shoulder kind of way, not a jump over the ice in a little red wagon kind of way. What? We need to take things a little slower, Todd, okay? Thanks. Pull over. Um, okay. What seems to be the trouble, Mauricia? It's Mo. Officer Mo, walking a little fast, weren't ya? I don't know. Was I? Watch it, young man. I've seen folks hoping half your speed. They trip, fall, knees scraped, lives ruined. Not a pretty sight. I'm writing you up a ticket, cutie pie. It's for your own safety. <laughs> Drama Club! Romeo, Romeo, Juliet, Juliet, we're in love, now we're dead! <laughs> Push blast off button, yes? Sammy, he do countdown. Hmm. Um. Maybe we should try someone else. Oh, Todd. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Todd. <sighs> and here's your gift, Todd. Wow, Mauricia. Thanks. I like your idea better, Todd. We can build a shelter for just the two of us. Doesn't that sound romantic? Um, Mauricia, this isn't about romance. It's about survival. Oh, you always have an excuse. I'll show you how to survive. Mauricia, I'm just trying to use some common sense here. Ha! This is no time for common sense. Back away from our fort, Todd. What? It's our fort. And our stuff! We built it, we prepared. Oh, it's all about you, 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 isn't it? If you had just decided to survive with me instead of everyone else, we wouldn't be having this problem. What? So this is all about you? No, you. 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 You! You want action? I'll give you action. Action! Todd! You can't go in there! I may never see you again! I'll be fine, Mauricia. Like I said, these Nick stories are fake. But you don't know that for sure, Todd! 
What if this is our last moment together? Forever! I can't let you go in there without one last special kiss. <gasps> Good morning, Todd. Oh, uh, hey, Mauricia. It's really nice to see you. Um, thanks. Next caller. Dr. Dana, there's this boy. Let's call him Todd. I like him, but I'm not sure if he likes me. Do you ever show him you like him? Oh, yes. I hit him all the time. Hmm, you hit him. Right in the shoulder. I've seen her. <laughs> Men are hunters. If you hunt them, they won't be interested. Let him come to you. So I should avoid him. Then Todd, <gasps> uh, I mean, Todd, will come to me? Absolutely. Give him lots of space. He'll miss your pretty face. Of course, it rhymes. It must work. Problem solved. Hmm, hmm. Mauricia's giving me a lot of space. Gee, I miss her pretty face. Hey, Mauricia! Wait, there's an empty seat here. Thank you, Dr. Dana. Dana, what have you done? Ah! Dr. Dana now says I should start hitting Todd again. Harder! The Dr. Dana show has officially been canceled. Please ignore any advice you have received. I are squared. Come on. Come on. I admit, it's kind of nice to actually spend time with your friends instead of always trying to beat them. Especially your special friends. No need to make that fist square. Round it up. And those wheels, too. My fault? Oh, no, 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 no. See, this is what really happened. Help! Stop what? With amazing... Sports action skills, because I need extreme help! Extreme help is on the way! She loves me. She loves me not. She... Whoa! <gasps> she loves me! I must take my run! <gasps> Mauricia! <gasps> Ah! Ugh, can't move. I can't bear to watch you suffer so. I will avenge you. No! So it's his fault, is it? Todd was so overcome with emotion at seeing me hurt. He went nuts. That's what happens when boys fall in love. Where will we get a third Eric? <gasps> me! I'll be an Eric! Anything to be in the same row as... Oh, Todd. My name's uh -huh. Eric now. Eric who loves Todd. Um, are you sure about this? What? But Fluffy loves you. Eric's can't have pets, Todd. It's in the rules. So just watch Fluffy until I get the other Eric's to move my seat back here. Then we can all be together like one happy family. <sighs> nice, Fluffy. Must get closer to Todd. Hey! Are you looking at my notes? Me? Uh, no. <laughs> it's okay if you were, because we Eric's always help each other out with our homework. Yeah. Let me see your homework, Eric who loves Todd. Wait. This isn't homework. It's hearts and flowers and the name Todd written a zillion times. Oh, that? Uh, that's just my lunch. Are you okay, Eric? Yes. I'm fine, Eric. Now trade seats with me, Eric. Okay, Eric. 
No, I meant him, Eric. Oh, why didn't you say so, Eric? Uh, Eric and Eric, I want to sit back there in front of Todd. Can I just do that, huh? Whoa, don't have to get all snippy about it, Eric. Right, Eric? Yeah, Eric. Eric and I'll let you sit there. <laughs> right after we ride our bicycle built for three. Yay! Bicycle built for who? <laughs> so then I says, do you think Todd likes me, likes me, or likes me, likes me? I think he likes me. What do you think? You Eric's give like the best advice ever. But we haven't even said anything. Exactly. Now, can we trade seats like you promised, Eric? <laughs> oh, Todd. Finally, we can sit next to each other. Great. Mauricia, or Eric, whoever, take Fluffy. I haven't moved in hours. I need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Not so fast, Eric, who loves Todd. What do you want, little... And take your fluffy. Sorry, Todd. All I wanted was to sit next to you. You know, you could have just asked. Really? Then, can I sit next to you? Well, there's no seat here. But I'll sit with you at lunch if you want. Whoa! Awesome! How about in the playground, too? And on the bus? And even when we're not at school? Well, uh, yeah. What about in high school and college? Can I sit next to you at your first job? And when you're not eight years old, can I sit beside you then, even if you're old and stinky? He's so cute. Love. Ow! What the? I think this is yours. I don't want it. Okay. I'll read it to you. What? No, no, no. Mauricia ah. says, no. Dear Todd, I really like you. Give it to me. Ahem. How about, I love all Eric's. They rock. Todd loves the Eric's. If Mauricia hears that, she's going to have a hissy. Oh, Todd. <laughs> Wah! Dear Mauricia, the days grow longer every second I'm without you. But I still love the Eric's more than you. As I gaze at you from across the room, one thing enters my mind. Myron is the best. Your feet are smelly. You smile like a jack-o'-lantern? I didn't write any of this. Yikes, Mauricia can't see this. See what, Todd? How much you love me? Todd, did you just throw a million little pieces of paper up in the air? Uh, um... No! These million pieces are actually mine, Mrs. Jules. I'll take care of them. Phew. Wait, what do you mean by that? Yikes! What you're doing, you're playing hard to get. Green game! Uh -huh. Todd, you've made me tilt. What is the meaning of this? It's my uh, test paper. I'm just handing it in. Oh, very well, then. Let's see how you've scored. Hmm, you've capitalized love correctly. Ah. Oh. But I'm not so sure that's how you spell smelly feet. <laughs> what else does it say? Well, he compared you to a pumpkin. What? That's actually a compliment. No, it's not. B minus. I would have given you a better grade, but you made Mauricia's mm -hmm. nose too long in this drawing. Let's see. No. Stop that cow! Ah! 
What's this? The name's been torn off, and it's got hearts all over it. That's because it's a love note from... From our entire class. For me? Really, it is. See all the different handwriting? Jack o lantern smile. Why, yes, I'm quite proud of that. <laughs> this must be about me. Actually, Mr. Kidswater. Please, Maricia, I'm already in trouble. If they find out I had anything to do with that note, I'll be riding that kindergarten bus home forever. Okay, but only if you do something for me. Okay, what? Oh, Todd, remember that thing you promised me before? Yes, I remember. You want me to write you a new note. But the thing is, I didn't even write you the last one. Don't worry. We'll help you again. Dearest Maricia, you are so extreme. <laughs> and almost as popular as Myra. Oh, 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 and the oh, Eric's oh, rule. Oh, yeah. oh, 